Hello again. Today we are unboxing Renfeld's sewing box as seen in his apartment. Let's start. As you see, it's from Singer. It's um, retail price is like $65, but I was able to get it at 50% off at Joanne's. Sorry, some items. Okay. A list of various things and instructions on how to use it. Right. I should probably read the instructions. Release front latch. So that's this thing. And then, oh, oh, okay. So then we have a sheet of plastic holding things together. I'm a little disappointed in the threads that are included, or I should say the spools, because for $65, they include like, I don't know, two millimeters thickness of thread in the spool. But um, it's hard to tell from just looking, but the quality of the thread seems okay. Um, for those of you who want to know every single color that comes with this kit, here are the big spools. On to you. Part two. Okay, we have an empty drawer. That's here. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is fancy. Observe. So it opens up into an empty compartment and one full of threads for hand sewing. Once again, as you see, it is mostly just air. And here we have all the little spoons. I just now realized as I was arranging these that there are no red or green in these big spools. <laughs> it's a pretty big omission. And then they have three each of white and black. And honestly, y'all could have just used a little less air in the spools. And then you wouldn't have to make all these duplicates. I want to point out this part that the spools are all on the little sticks which is pretty awesome. Like the same for the little spoons. I think I'm gonna be putting my bobbins on these so that there isn't like a chaos and a tangle of threads. Look at these. The dots are third layer from the top. Next. Ooh. So this thing has six compartments. Ah, so okay, you can open three at a time. So I like guess. And here you have some safety pins, gold and silver, dressmaker's pins. These are nice because they don't have the little balls on them, so even though they're hard to see, they also won't bunch up the fabric as much. And we have some pretty darn tiny buttons. So, I don't know, it's for like doll clothes. Um, ooh, okay, we have some different different fasteners. He doesn't want to catch the focus. Oh, there we go. And some snaps. All right. And we have a bunch of tiny needles. I hope Robert has really good eyesight because the holes on the vast majority of these are so tiny. There is like one of these needles has a decent enough hole or I, I guess is the English word for it. And we have one, two, three, three needle threaders. I'm gonna need those. I'm not sure if they're actually gonna fit through those needles. And I am now tempted to try. Next book. There are a lot of needles. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, it fits. Good news. Is it a thread? Yes, all right. Success. The needles work. But better not lose these things. Because these needles might be easier you're gonna need them. Okay, and finally we have three tiny thimbles. And yeah, I don't know if will if they will fit a bigger hand. My hands are pretty small. 
Okay, and now we have one last compartment to go. We have <laughs> drainage touch. We have a plasticky measuring tape that is both in inches and in centimeters. So that's nice actually. And then we have a seam ripper. See the problem with some theme rippers? Seam rippers is that they don't actually sharpen the part, like the cutting part in the middle here. See, then it doesn't cut very well. So, it's a decent one. It's okay. And oh, there are some scissors, like just little ones. It says on the cover that it's fabric scissors. And this is the interesting part. So they came with a little protector for the tip, but the protector wasn't on the scissors. And then it also came with a bag for scissors, but it wasn't on the scissors either. So that's kind of odd. But, and the final, final part is a little pin cushion. And I mean little. That wraps it up, so let's put it back. There we go. Once again, this thing closes, and then it holds all the compartments locked. And then we snap it shut, and we have this convenient little travel case. So I'm not crazy about the contents of it like you said the thread very little amount of it included and scissors are good but everything else the needles um the tiny buttons it seems a little bit perfunctory the tiny tiny pin cushion um yeah so for the container maybe it's worth it probably would not pay $60 for it, but it's from Crawford, so no regrets. Bye-bye.